Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Trouble Free. In today's video, I'm going to explain you about the concept of Strayson's matrix multiplication in the subject of design and analysis of algorithm. So this video is going to be a little shorter, like when compared to all the other videos in this playlist, because all the videos are were taking a lot of time. So this is going to be a little shorter. So yeah, let's get into the video. And this is also an application of divide and conquer algorithm only. In divide and conquer, we have binary search and we have merge sort we have quick sort and we have this Strayson's matrix multiplication okay still we have so many applications of divide and conquer but according to JNTU head syllabus these are the four applications we have okay in the previous three videos we completed those three uh, these three um, algorithms now we are going to do this Strayson's matrix multiplication so you know what is matrix multiplication right you already know what is matrix multiplication how you will multiply two matrices suppose you have these two matrices how you will multiply them this row with this column and this row with this column again this row with this column this row with this column that is how you are going to do the matrix multiplication so if the order is of 2 by 2 or if the order is of 3 by 3 you know how to do the matrix multiplication but if the order is increasing then how can you multiply two matrices so when the order is increasing it will become hard for you to do the multiplication so in order to reduce the complexity of that Strayson has given us something let us see what he gave us okay so how do you multiply these two a11 into b11 plus a12 into b21 so that is what so the resulting will be c11 so for c12 what you will do this row into this column you will do right that means a11 b12 a11 b12 a12 and b22 so same like for the c21 also this row into this column you will do a21 b11 plus a22 b21 okay and for c22 this row into this column you will do that means a21 b12 and a22 b22 so that is what i have written here so if it is a regular matrix multiplication you will do in this way for 2 by 2 matrices then in case if you have a 4 by 4 matrix then what you will do okay in case of 4 by 4 matrix what we will do is this is a 4 by 4 matrix right and this is also a 4 by 4 matrix so you are going to find out the mid value mid is equal to 4 divided by 2 so 2 okay and here also mid is equal to 4 divided by which is equal to 2 that means you are breaking it into 2 by 2 matrices okay that means see like this you are going to break it okay so now this will become a11 this will become a12 this will become a13 a14 a1 sorry b11 b12 i'm really sorry guys this is a21 i'm really sorry and this is a22 okay and this will become b21 and this will become b22 okay now again these are like a two by two matrices only right a11 a12 a21 a22 b11 b12 b21 b22 so they are like two by two matrices you will directly multiply them by assuming them as a two by two matrices okay so for this also we have an algorithm i will show you that algorithm wait so yeah this is your algorithm so you are doing matrix multiplication you are having two matrices matrix a matrix b and n is the order of the matrix okay and if n is less than or equal to 2 that means if the order of the matrix is less than or equal to 2 if the order of the matrix is 1 or if the order of matrix is 2 then what you can do you can directly use these four formulas these four formulas and find out the resulting matrix okay what you will be what is your resulting matrix here c11 c12 c21 c22 is your resulting matrix right so you can find all these four elements directly but if your order of your matrix is greater than 2 then what you will do okay mid is equal to n by 2 first that is what we did here mid is equal to 4 by 2 so after doing mid is equal to n by 2 you are doing matrix multiplication of a11 and b11 that is you are multiplying a11 matrix with b11 
ओके एंड देन यू आर डूइंग ए वन टू एंड बी वन टू एंड देन यू आर एडिंग दीज टू थिंग्स लाइक दैट सो यू आर डूइंग मैट्रिक्स मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ ए वन वन एंड बी वन वन प्लस मैट्रिक्स मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ ए वन टू एंड बी टू वन लाइक दिस यू आर डूइंग नॉर्मल मैट्रिक्स मल्टीप्लीकेशन ओनली बट हियर इंस्टेड ऑफ नंबर्स यू हैव मैट्रिक्स इट सेल्फ ओके सो हियर वॉट एवर मल्टीप्लीकेशन यू आर डूइंग बिटवीन ए वन वन एंड बी वन वन दैट इज नॉट बिटवीन टू नंबर्स दैट इज बिटवीन टू मैट्रिसेस ओके इन द सेम वे द सेम फॉर्मुलाज गाइज सेम formulas you will get here also but instead of multiplying numbers you are multiplying the matrices over here okay now this is normal matrix multiplication then what is stresen's matrix multiplication let us see we have some set of formulas for that so stresen has give us given us some formulas so these are those formulas p is equal to a11 plus a22 into b11 b11 plus b22 that means here you are adding a11 and a22 matrices a11 and a22 matrices you are adding b11 and b22 matrices you are adding and you are multiplying both of them okay so you are multiplying both of them here also you are adding these two matrices and you are multiplying it with b11 like that you have seven formulas for this okay Stresen has given you seven formulas, and by using the values which you got from these formulas, you are going to find out the value for C one one, C one two, C two one, C two two, and then you will be getting you will be getting the same four by four matrix again. Okay, you will get the same four by four matrix again, which is the resultant of A and B, which is A multiplied with B. Okay, so first, what you have to do, you have to find out the value of P Q R S T U V, and then you are going to substitute these values in these formulas. Okay, and then you will get your resultant matrix again. Okay, so then what is the difference? What is the benefit of this Stresen's matrix multiplication? See here, how many times you are doing matrix multiplication? Here one, here two. Here three a one one into here a two two into so four, five, six, seven. How many times did you perform matrix multiplication here? Seven times. In case of this, where is our algorithm? Yeah. In case of this algorithm, how many times you are performing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight times you are performing. So here you are performing only for seven times. but there you are doing for eight times so you your matrix multiplication reduced by one unit right so matrix multiplication is something which is going to take lot of time okay so one unit of time is reduced if you are following the stresen's matrix multiplication instead of going with this regular matrix multiplication algorithm okay that is all about stresen's matrix multiplication simple you have to use you have to first break your given parent matrix into number of sub matrix that is you are dividing them you are solving them you are conquer and then you are applying these values in these formulas again and then you are getting the final matrix which is of the order 4 by 4 okay done so yeah this is all about this video very short one as i said thanks for watching the video till the end if you're still having any doubts let me know in the comment section and consider subscribing to my channel if you like my content